A refrigeration plant is rated at 15 tons capacity. That sounds like our QA. 15 tons of refrigerant. Let's convert that into BTU per hour. And that should equate to 180,000 British thermal units per hour. How many pounds of air per hour will it cool from 70 degrees Fahrenheit to 90 degrees Fahrenheit? So our final temperature is 90 degrees Fahrenheit. And our initial temperature is 70 degrees Fahrenheit. And the process is a constant pressure isobaric uh, process. And we're asked to find the mass of air per hour. Okay, so we know, we know that the equation for sensible heat is Q is equal to mc delta t. Well, our Q is just QA, trying to look for our mass. And since this is a constant pressure process, we're going to use the specific heat at constant pressure of air. And of course, our delta T is just T2 minus T1. We have our QA. We have CP at 0 0.24 BTU per pound degrees Renkine. And, of course, we have T2 and T1. We can simply start putting the values in now. So, that's QA. This is 0 0.24. Final temperature is 90 minus 70. Now, the reason I didn't convert this into absolute is that this is a difference and you will get the same value in Rankine regardless. So we might as well put degrees Rankine here. Let's include the units for our specific heat um, constant so we don't get confused. This is BTU pound mass degrees Rankine. So unit check, the Rankines cancel out, the BTUs cancel out, and we're left with the pounds and the units of time, which is an hour, which is exactly what we're looking for. So we can now find our mass Let's quickly put this in our calculator. 24 times 90 minus 70 is 20. And there you have it. 37,500 pounds per hour. And that is our final answer. I hope this helped you. If it did, consider supporting the channel on Patreon. Please like and subscribe for, for the algorithm and I'll see you in the next one.